Hi everyone. I'm here to do a quick haul and it's for the Elf collection of Beauty and the Beast. And I at first I was thinking, you know what, I don't need it. And I've already got plenty. I have more not more than enough. And you know, I need to save more money and you know, just pass on it. And then I was on Pinterest and then I saw the pictures of everything and I was in love and I was like you know what I need it in my life so I went to Walgreens and I was going to hit all the ones in my area but I got lucky and found them at the first store I went to so I, I know these have been put out pretty recently oh uh, like very, very recently so if you like any of this stuff go and get it it is beautiful so I'm just going to go ahead and get right into it I'm going to start off with the Beauty and the Beast stuff Belle is my favorite. I, I love Beauty and the Beast. I just love Disney in general. But something about Beauty and the Beast, I don't know, just the all the animate objects talking and the storyline so pretty. And then can we just talk about the red rose for a minute? It is so beautiful. I just think it's perfect. Just such a pretty image. Okay, so I'm going to start off with the bag. This is one of the makeup bags they had and this was $11.99. Just a beautiful Kind of pale yellow almost kind of metallic finish isn't that beautiful oh my goodness and it says bell right there oh my goodness beautiful and then another this is a little clutch and this was $7.99 and there's beast I guess they've been outside and he's gonna talk to her or something or maybe he's asking her to dance again I don't know but how beautiful look at this just love it really nice then the last bag this, these were all the bags that I saw there it comes in the plastic case this is $9.99 and there she is dancing with Beast as Prince Beast as the human <laughs> they're all watching it says Belle again just beautiful uh, let's see they had a highlighter um, like I guess a cheek trio so a highlighter blush and bronzer it's called the enchanted tail face palette the blush creates a flush of color to the cheeks the bronzer accents and contours cheekbones for beautiful definition and the highlighter creates a gorgeous glow so it's sort of just a peachy blush and a pretty dark bronzer I feel like I could use as an eyeshadow kind of scared of dark bronzers and then um pretty highlight and look at that was just beautiful look I love it a little, a little eyeshadow palette <clears throat> says the enchanted tail eyeshadow compact these ultra silky and lustrous eyeshadows go on smoothly for a flawless look they're just beautiful look at that kind of fun colors but they have a neutral tone to them so you could definitely use them for work or definitely within my comfort zone for sure very pretty. And then they had several lip products. This is a lip gloss. It says super glossy lip shine. So those, those are ones they normally do, but these are just colors and packaging for it, I guess. So ones are red. Beautiful sort of just a medium, maybe slightly pink red. And then a, uh, a nude that's not so concealer-like. I like those sort of nudes that don't make you look washed out. I feel like those make me look dead. Let's see, what are the colors of these? I don't see a name. Oh no. I thought for sure I'd have a name. Anyway, the red and the nude. And they also had a medium pink. And if I happen to see it, I might pick it up again. Um, they had several nail polishes, but I like this one the best. So I got this one. It's by Orly, and it's just a pale sort of ballerina pink. Very pretty. It's called Tea with Mrs. Potts. Who wouldn't want to have tea with Mrs. Potts? Just beautiful. The sun is kind of washing it out. Very pretty. Okay, so now on to the Disney Dare to Dream collection. They had bags and just a, an array of things for every single, um, for each character. They had Mulan, Pocahontas, and then Ariel from The Little Mermaid. So for Mulan, they had this beautiful bag. Look at that. 
oh my goodness, like the it's almost like a watercolor painting. This was $9.99. Just beautiful. And then they had some lip glosses and uh, liquid eyeliners, but I chose not to get those. But I did get the big palette they had, the Dare to Dream Mulan. Look at that, that is beautiful. Just a nice little book album. Oh, so pretty. It's got little instructions for how to use everything in the palette. Those are always nice. And then just beautiful colors inside. It also comes with a mirror. I don't wanna don't wanna blind you. But super, super pretty colors. So you get a lipstick and all the eyeshadows. Oh my goodness. And that was ten dollars, so really, really affordable. And then from the Pocahontas one I got bag, of course. Oh my goodness, look, just makes me think of the colors of the wind. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. And then this is the retractable luminizer. They had three shades, and I got Great Spirit. This was the lightest of the three. This is more of a neutral, pale champagne color. The next one was sort of a goldish color, and then a deeper bronzy one. So very, very pretty. Excited to use that. That was three dollars. And then of course I got the box set. Oh my goodness, look! So beautiful. Oh my goodness. And then there's instructions. Really just stunning. Oh my goodness, I'm in love. And then all the shadows and you get a lip gloss. A blush and a bronzer. I mean, listen to some of these names. So, Dreamcatcher, Wingapo, Heroin, Warrior, Willow. There's Willow. And then, what is that? Dreamcatcher. Just, I love all the names. It's so perfect. Oh my goodness. And then the Ariel. I love the Little Mermaid too. Oh my goodness. My three favorite Disney things uh, or Disney characters. I love the Lion King because I love animals. And then I love Beauty and the Beast. And then the Little Mermaid. Oh my goodness. Those three are perfection to me. So here's the Ariel bag. Look at that. Oh my gosh, the colors are beautiful. I wish Flounder were in here. That's the one thing, because Flounder's always with her. And then these, that bag was $11.99, I think, or $10.99, or $9.99. And then this is just an eyeshadow quad. Look at that packaging. This was $3. Can you believe that $3 for this? It's just, it, this isn't, oh, I can't even talk. It's so perfect. This is amazing for $3. Look at this. They could definitely charge way more. I'm glad they didn't, but oh my goodness, it is just so beautiful. Let me see if I can open it up real quick. And this one, they had they had two quads. This um, I got both of them. And this is called Sea Witch. Ooh, Witch of the Sea. You know, Chicken of the Sea. Fish of the Sea. And then Sea Witch. Hmm. So this one, these kind of make me think of Ursula, almost in color. I don't know, what do you guys think? Look at that beautiful gold aerial. Oh my goodness, beautiful. There's the colors. Really pretty. This is Sea Darling. Just a similar sort of packaging. Let's open it up. <clears throat> I was so excited. I only knew about the Beauty and the Beast collection because I figured uh, that they'd be bringing that out since they were making or the new Beauty and the Beast movies coming out with Emma Watson, which I really want to see. I'm obsessed with them making the Disney movies with real people. I saw that for years and they're finally very slowly doing it. So here is Sea Darling. It's really pretty sort of blues. Look at that periwinkle right there. That is really pretty. There we go. See, darling. And 
and then here's the day to dream box for her beautiful and the instructions and then the inside oh my gosh look at that can you oh, it's beautiful I'll read some of the names so treasures gadgets gizmos snarf snarf flat <laughs> I think that isn't that the pipe in um, the little mermaid thingamabobs dingle hopper who's it's and what's it's and oceanid <laughs> oh my gosh it's so cute oh wow then one more thing and this was the dare to dream little lip set they had this was five dollars can you believe that five dollars for that oh my goodness just perfect and this the whole set is called kiss the girl how cute oh my gosh i didn't see that in the store that is so cute oh i can't I almost can't stand it it's so cute oh if i could just get this open so what do you what do you guys like as far as disney goes who's your favorite princess like which disney movie is your favorite of all time if you had to pick one or how i name three what are your top three comment down below I know that at Disney World, um, gosh, they had, they were in the middle of constructing the, the new restaurant for the Beauty and the Beast section. Uh, I think it's called Be Our Guest, and it looks so, so amazing. I wanted to go, but it wasn't open, so, you know, you know how those things go. On to other things, but here's just the lip set. So cute. I'm not even, I mean, how can you pass that up? That is so pretty. So that is everything. Um, if you've tried any of this stuff, let me know what you think. I just think, I know, I trust Elf Quality. I mean, I know it's not going to be, you know what? I'm, I've always been very happy with Elf products. Um, I love how affordable they are. And this is just what they've done with the packaging and everything. And for the price. You really can't be that everyone can have a little bit of Disney in their life for really reasonable. And I think that is fantastic. What else can I, I can't ask for anything more than that, right? So um, thank you for watching and comment down below what was your favorite item. I think my favorite item was, oh shoot, I, I don't think I can pick. I really like the Beauty and the Beast um, eyeshadow palette, but of the Ariel stuff. I like the big palette of hers the best, so that was it. I was so excited. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. Okay, bye.